Try to try to think of, you know, you're you're looking at your turn in. Try to think of at the point that you get to the turn in. Make sure that you still have a little bit of break on everywhere. Okay. So you, when you turn in here, you want a little break on. Much better. You see how much easier yeah. that is. I mean, that's that's a that's a more elementary way to kind of think about it, but it it, it kind of gets you programmed to do the right thing. If that makes sense. Even here. There you go. It's just that initial. Remember, depending on the angle of the corner, you don't always need to go to a threshold pressure. It, it just depends on right. the angle of the turn, right? Like this is not a threshold. This is just a brush. Look in and then go. There you go. This is more of a threshold. Break hard. There you go. Now look in and go. This is this is, but it's just a split second. Break. Now look in. Good, but hold the brake a little longer. Remember, you want to. Hold the brake until the car actually starts to turn. Until you get to the turn in point, right? Good. Nice job. Just with the throttle then, it was enough adjustment. Really good. And again, a little too early. He's out now. No, you're good. Hold the brake until you turn in. Hold. Better. Good. Try to wait for that turn in point, that'll make this a little easier. To the apex. Breakthrough, good. Oh. You're, what you're doing is you're lifting off the gas at that brake sign. Remember that there's no lift point, so that sign is actually where you need to be on the brake. That'll help you next time you go in there. Just to, to lift a little before the brake sign that makes it makes it where you're not into the ABS the whole time. 